So we all know we're on the final countdown to receiving our iPhone 15 series. And let me know in the comment section down below, what color did you decide to go with? Yes, I remained born as hell and went with the black titanium, but it is what it is. Let me know what colors you got down below. But today we're going to get into the best early case recommendations for your 15 Pro Max. Now, I know we're not doing case reviews without the phone. You know, we don't get down like that over on Technically T channel, but I do have some cases that have been proven known to be great cases in the past. Some that you can go out and pick up right now. I think all of these are either on Amazon Prime, which you can definitely get them this week, or you can get it from another company who ships really quickly. So you'll still have it available for your 15 Pro Max when they get here, because we know they got to go directly up into some protection. So let's go ahead and get into the first one. One that's always an OG on the channel. Let's go ahead and talk about the new mouse limitless for the 15 Pro Max. Now, they made some nice subtle changes, some changes that I would have like to see a little bit more when it comes to their cases, but these case companies are listening. A few that I have on this desk, they are listening. So let's go ahead and get into it. So as you can see right here, you're going to have the Aramid Fiber Mouse Limitless line. If you know anything about their line, they do offer a few other finishes. They have walnut, they have a, a, a leather finish, a speckled rubber finish. So they got a few different variations that you can go out there and choose from, but you know I'm Aramid Fiber all the things. One thing you can tell from the difference of the new versus the old mouse is they added a little mouse emblem down here by the camera bump. Now my my opinion i feel like it's getting a little bit of redundancy when it comes on the back with your branding you have the mouse logo here you have the mouse branding down here all we need is one and i think it's the the, the less the better so i think if you remove down here you don't have to plaster the brand everywhere we know what the limitless line is all right it's an og but as you see with the rest of the case you're going to get you know fairly what you're known for when it comes to the limitless line you're going to get a little lanyard loop you're going to get your grips on the side which they actually changed up for the 14 model which i'm very happy to see because it does add a little bit of grip to your phone when you have the case in here so we we always want that as you can see you're going to get your volume up and down and you're going to get a dedicated button for the action switch that's one thing that we're really going to play close attention to when it comes to the case reviews for the 15. Did you just not put it there or did you put a button? The consensus says most of us want a button out there when it comes to the, to the action button. So very nice to see, of course. And then on the inside, you're going to get a nice soft line and you're going to get that MagSafe. MagSafe is going to be standard ground, nothing too strong. Mouse never really blows you away with MagSafe, but I do feel like it's a little bit stronger. So of course, we're going to get to test that MagSafe when we get the 15 Pro Max in. But one major change that I think a lot of ma mouse owners can rejoice and I feel like they listen to all of us fellow creators who've been complaining about this for years for years. They finally made the cutouts correct on the bottom. Can I just give a, a hand clap the mouse because we have been complaining about that about that for years and they finally fixed it. So good job mouse when it comes to that. But other than that, you're gonna get your standard mouse protection. This is always gonna be a good look. You're gonna be able to drop your phone. If you have the case of the drop seeds, the mouse limitless line has always been some of the top cases when it comes to perfection protection. I've always enjoyed them. They're always in my rotation of my personal devices. So I'm not going to recommend anything to you that I would not use daily. In every one of these cases, I have no problem using daily on my phone. So the Mouse Limitless line for the 15 series is going to be always another solid option. But they made some noticeable improvements. We'll like to see a few other things cleaned up. But we'll get into that when we actually review the case itself. Now, this one is one that I am super excited for. I'm not going to... I hate to go ahead and put that bug out there early but i feel like this is will be a potential number one case when we start doing our top 10 cases and this is going to be the pataka mag easy pro case for the 15 pro max and they have made some nice improvements some that we have been talking about for a very long time it's good to see people listening as i always say let's go ahead and step through it so in the pataka pro case you're going to get a nice metallic border that goes around the camera before it was rubber it's good to see them up in their quality a little bit man give us these metal rings when you pay a certain price point like you would pay for the pataka pro case you're going to want certain features and that's what i've always complained about when it comes to their cases so you're going to get a nice metal band that goes around your camera pataka branding of course you're going to get aramid fiber aramid fiber all the things one major improvement when it came to the buttons because that was a pain point last year on the 14 model that they had to kind of come up with a, a revised model and fix is the buttons this year they bought the metal button so you're going to get a shiny button here for your power button and over here on the other side as you can see you're going to get a raised volume up and down button and a dedicated action button and mouse bra mouse pataka bravo for doing that man that just these are little things that i've been wanting to see and it's glad to see you've been doing it on one of the best cases that i feel like is out there for the 15 series or the 14 series 
the Potaka Pro case just always brings the heat. It's good to see those improvements getting done. On the inside, you're going to get that nice lining. You're going to get your mag safe. It doesn't give you the little alignment bottom line, the magnet, the alignment magnet, but it's fine. It, I don't think you need it. It does help. So I would like for it to be there, but I still think it's going to be just fine. On the bottom, you're going to get your accurate cutouts. And this is just going to be standard Pataka, man. Going to be very nice and firm going around the sides. And this year, not only are they coming out with the black model, they're also bringing us a blue model and a red model. That's going to be like Aramid fiber pattern, which is absolute fire. It's good to see them because they always make it so nice for their fusion weave for the regular Mag Easy case. It's finally... Nice to see them bring some of that, some of that, that, that drip over to the to the pro case. I'm, I'm with that. I can get down with that, man. So the Pataka Pro Case giving us the nice improvements, metallic ring, metallic buttons, and I just cannot wait to get the 15 Pro Max into this case so you can check it out. The Pataka Pro Case is always a case that's in my top 10. I guarantee it will be in my top 10. Every one of these cases that I'm probably talking about on this list will be. You will see it again in my top 10 videos. But the Pataka Pro case is one that I am super excited to get on my 15 Pro Max because I, I think this might be a daily case for me. Now, this one right here, let's take it to a, a former champ. Matter of fact, it may be the current champ on the channel because it's always a champ until I do a new video. Let's talk about the Binks Armor Pro for the 15 Pro Max. Now, they've made some nice improvements to this one as well compared to the 14 Pro Max model. So you're looking at this once again, era mid fiber. I know you're like, man, is this a, a best era mid fiber video? No, it's not. It's just some of the best cases that I like. So you're going around the ring, you're going to have that metallic band, as you can see, with the Binks logo. We saw this on the Armor Air version last season, I guess we could say for the 14. It's glad to see they brought that ring over to the Pro case because I really loved it. And I love anytime you can give me a metallic ring, just, just do it, all right? On the sides, you're going to get that metallic button here. And on the sides, the same thing. You're going to get the volume up and down with that action button now I, I like this i like what they did with the action button by putting a little orange line right there but I, I don't know how that's gonna last over time i don't feel like you have to put that just put the button there you don't have to get cute you know you don't gotta get cute man it's just just put the button there and i think it'll be just fine but we'll see how that does over time on the inside you're going to get your mag safe you get that alignment ring and then on, on the mag safe thing i mean bix is bringing it when it comes to the mag safe strength some of the strongest magnets out there especially when it came to the 14 i'm pretty sure we're gonna see the same thing with the 15 so very good mag safe magnets I would have liked to see a little bit of fiber on the inside, but it's all good. Not that big to worry about. On the bottom side, you see your, your ports are good to go. And other than that, another very, very firm, tight fitting case. You can grab this over on Amazon so you can get that prime in and get this order in. It's just a solid case, man. The Binks Pro just emerged and became one of the best cases out there. And trust me, it will be one of the best cases out there if you want to protect your 15 Pro Max. Just nice, minimal, has that protection with that Kevlar and just checks all the boxes when we're talking about buttons, quality, mag safe strength, fit. It really checks all the boxes. And that's the reason why it was number one case. So definitely go out there and grab this one. I do not think you'll be disappointed. Now, I know all of us are looking for a leather counterpart since Apple said, you know what? We're not going to make the leather cases anymore. They came out with that woven fabric, but we're not going to talk about that. We're just going to get into that when I get the 15 Pro Max because I want to use that case I, because I think it's trash. But if you're looking for a leather case, man, look no further than the Andar Aspen. Now, I know. You've seen Andar all over the place on my channel. I just think they make some of the best leather cases that's out there available and especially available early. There's a lot of leather case companies who make amazing cases, but they're not available right now. And most of us have to have our cases before we get the actual phone, like me. It's going to a phone as soon as I get the as soon as I get that phone up in here. But let's go ahead and take a look at the Andar Aspen. This one is going to be in that nice camo tan colorway that I absolutely love from them. So you're going to get the same thing. You're going to get your nice metallic ring. You're going to get your power button, your volume up and down. Now, this is one thing that I have to kind of, I got to kind of ding Andar for. And I mentioned it to them. I was just at their headquarters maybe a few weekends ago. Because if you don't know, we actually came out with a collab case, which is called Technically Red, that is available for the 14 series and the 15 series. So make sure you go out there and get your Technically Red if you are looking for a fire red leather. But even with this, I'm always keeping 100 with y'all. Even with our collab, with our case, I still have to kind of nitpick at this and say I really, really, really Andor if you're watching this. I really wish we could have version, did a version with the actual button. That's a little bit of a miss in my opinion because I don't think that many companies are doing the non-button thing. They're all having the button on and I think that is going to be the way to go. Of course, we don't know. It's all speculation to see how that's going to do if you have just a cutout. But me knowing cases, knowing how they fit, I believe 
that could be a pain point for some. Some, it may not matter. So definitely, it really depends on how you're vibing with it. But on the inside, you're going to get a nice, smooth, you know, liner on the inside and dark. You're going to get that magnet, nice metallic buttons, very nice fit. These are going to patina up very well over time. So they have this color. They have a bunch of different colors. Right now, at launch, they have about four or five colors that you can choose from. But, you know, accurate cutouts on the bottom. You get very decent MagSafe strength for a leather case. And that I really can appreciate because sometimes leather cases lack a little bit when it comes to the MagSafe strength, but not when it comes to the Andar Aspen. So you can go out there and pick this up in the various colors. You can pick this up in the Technically Red. So if you're looking for a leather case, and I'm not just saying that because of the collab. If you go back and look at my previous videos, the Andar was probably one of, another case the leather case was up there as well, but it's always gonna be one of the best options, especially when it comes to quality with that full grain leather for your 15 Pro Max. So don't worry about not having the Apple leather case. It's not good, man. Just go out there and get something like this or another counterpart who has nice quality leather case. Cases. You already know when I get them in, we doing the best leather cases for the 15 Pro Max. Last but not least, you know we got to keep it up with another OG. It's Bigger Brother was on the channel a little bit, of, on this video a little earlier, man, and we got to talk about the Pataka Mag Easy 3 case. Look, this is just going to be another one that's tried and true. If you're going to be a person who is looking for that minimal protection, and especially this year since we have those titanium sides, a lot of you may not want to cover your phone up all the way because titanium, we know, really, you know, stands true to the time, man. And this Apple Watch Ultra has been here since release and it barely has any marks on it so i want to say that titanium finish around our iphones are going to be the same way and i hope so when a lot of people even like myself i kind of don't want to cover those sides up so you might want something that's going to expose your top that's going to expose your bottom but this is going to be very thin minimal protection pataka mag easy now this is going to be the fusion weave version you can have a few different versions that have like a couple fusion weave patterns or you can just get flat black just want to keep it all stealthy especially if you have that titanium or the titanium black that's going to be a good option for you but this one right here man it's just it always gets the job done they really have a nice metallic ring that goes around the camera really nice to see but you're going to get cutouts for all of your functions your buttons your your top and the bottom all that's going to be a cutout but this is going to be very thin very light so if you're a person who don't really care for much on your phone but pataka mag easy is always going to be a great option because they're giving you nice quality products this isn't any cheap stuff this is not any cheap knockoff amazon cases you can go out there and get they're always going to be one of the best companies who can do the thin cases and do them very well so go out there and check them out but let's go ahead and get them all back up in the in the, the camera scene let's just check it man these just gonna be a few some of you it may be personal preference no i don't have a clear case because right now i don't have a clear case that i have that i can strongly recommend yet i gotta see i'm just talking about the cases that i have so far and the ones that i've ordered for myself which i feel like are some of the best right now for the 15 pro max bix armor pro mouse limited slime pataka pro pataka mag easy 3 and the andar aspen so the links down below to every one of these man if you already got your cases let me know down below what case you already got and you ready to rock when you get your 15 pro max in